Hello, and it's David calling from London. Good morning to you. Am I right in saying that, so when you started uh, Cinema Verite, it was very much used in documentaries, but wasn't very much used in actual news bulletin programmes, and I, we were wondering why that was. Um, it's, it's my opinion that uh, Cinema Verite, or, or, or whatever you want to call it, requires um, a degree of time and artistry <laughs> that the news people don't have time for. And um, the news people uh, are generally um, focused on uh, the news readers, the, uh, the name, name people who they have on the set. This is Manhattan, business center of New York City. In the 1960s, Robert Drew, working for Life magazine, created a storm in the U.S. worthy of any major current internet buzz. Drew, on the right here, working with friends, Penny Baker, Leacock here, and Albert Mazels, who died only last week, miniaturized a standard news camera that also took in sound. So it went from this... <sighs> To this what many news networks would use the video journalism one-man band concept was possible senator the vice president in his campaign has said that you are naive and at times immature he has raised the question then they scored a major coup with a film presidential hopeful john kennedy Instead of static studio shots, they went mobile. The film, Primary, announced itself as a new style, cinema journalism. With shots like this, no reporters, the plot unfolds with life's characters, the camera is you. suggest that from the onset then the construction of news went down a path that was somewhat limited. I think I think the idea of news is limited, um, the way it's practiced. Uh, it's practiced mainly by people with word um, journalism backgrounds. That may not be true in England but it's true here. Um, they think in terms of, of written Stuff, and spoken stuff instead of showing stuff. And when they have a chance to show something, they'll talk over it <laughs> and laugh it up. The load has been carried by individuals who rose up and made great films. That's, that's the good part of what's happened. In the future, if, if, the, if we extend the lines of what we see, we're going to see a lot of uh, individual posturing uh, in the name of reporting or in the name of Verite even. Uh, and in fact, we are seeing that. My hope is that because more people are going to become literate about film, more people are going to be able to make films because cameras are cheaper and easier that a new batch of talents will rise up making great films. Um, but right now, the internet, internet business is so chaotic and people are so confused and especially young, young people who would like to make films um, are confused that um, I don't think I don't think the future has emerged yet. <laughs>